Hey everyone, welcome back to my tutorial. In this tutorial, I am going to show you, how to create a liquid text fill animation, using SVG element of HTML. Before proceeding further, please be sure, to drop a like on this video, and subscribe to my channel, for more such tutorials. So, without any further ado, let's get started. Open your code editor. Then, create an HTML file. Use the link tag to include our CSS file. In the body, create a SVG element. Set its view box attribute to 0, 0, 120, where first two numbers are starting XY coordinates, and other two are width and height respectively. Create a linear gradient element, with ID as gradient. Use SVG's stop element, to define a color to use on a gradient. Pass your color to its stop color attribute. Now, create a pattern element, with ID as wave. Set value of X attribute to 0. Set value of Y attribute to minus 0 0.5. Set value of width, and height attributes to 100%. Set value of pattern units attribute, to user space on use, which basically tells to use user's coordinate system. Now, here comes the important part of drawing a path. So be sure, to follow this part correctly. Create a path element, with ID as wave path. Set value of D attribute to M minus 40 9 Q minus 30 7 minus 20 9 T0 9 T20 9 T40 9 T60 9 T80 9 T100 9 T120 9 V20 H-40Z Make sure, every alphabet, except the last Z, are in uppercase. Set value of fill attribute to URL of gradient ID. Inside the path element, create an animate transform element, which is used to animate SVG elements. Set value of its attribute name attribute to transform.
Set value of begin attribute to 0 seconds. Set value of dot attribute to 1.5 seconds. Set value of type attribute to translate. Set value of from attribute to 0. Set value of to attribute to 40. Set value of repeat count attribute to indefinite. Use the text element to draw text. Set its text anchor attribute to middle. Set value of its x attribute to 50. Set value of its y attribute to 15. Set value of font size attribute to 17. Set fill attribute to color of your choice. You can put your text inside the text tag. Now, make a duplicate of this tag, and change the fill attribute to URL of wave ID. So, our HTML part is ready. Let's write the CSS. Let's do a quick CSS reset. For the body, set display to flex. Set justify content to center. Set align items to center. Set height to 100 VH. For the SVG element, set font weight to bold. Set max width to 640 pixels. Set height to 100%. You can scale the element to the size of your choice using scale function. So here, our final project is ready. Let's see the preview. It is looking great. So, that's all for today. Hope you have enjoyed the tutorial. Please be sure, to drop a like on this video, and subscribe to my channel, for more such tutorials. So, I will meet you next time, till then, good luck, and peace.